as he steps in the match. The Almeida JJ product is fighting Delson Pedeschumbo Eleno. Here is Delson. And here we go for the 18th battle of the night. We have 30 fights for today in a total including the semi-finals, the final and the other international challenges that are scheduled for today we have an Ogi challenge between Joaquin Mamucci and Danny Gerard the brown belt challenge between Felipe Trovo and Felipe Pomaski and the women challenge between Raquel Paluhi from the US fighting Renata Marinho Delson in the white gi, Caio Almeida in the blue gi, here we have six minutes to go, they both need the win. Delson has already fought the strongest guy, look for Caio Almeida going for the choke and Delson was able to, to put his head out. Great moment for Caio. And he almost finished the fight with less than a minute. <laughs> the referee interrupts the fight and puts Delson again in the half guard. Playing in the top, Kai Walmeda is in the bottom. And there they go. Dawson's trying to create space. Kai once again trying to finish. He was looking for a lapel choke. He makes the grip. Pedrishum was in a position that he's been looking for this whole tournament. That top half guard with pressure. You know, unfortunately, Kai is on the receiving end of it. His hips very, very close towards the towards the ground. Kai is using a, a left hook in hope to sweep Pedrishum as he goes for the pass. But that's that's when the the old school meets the new generation, you know. Pedro was gonna try to go left. If that doesn't work, he's gonna bail and jump right. There you go. He has two options now. He can either go to uh, side control or full mount. He's working step by step, inch by inch. Look how Caio works in, in the half guard. He tries to go down, advance to a deep half guard, but Petty Shumba blocks his, his advance. With the left hand, very tight. Caio makes great use of the lapel. You know, he uses that to sweep. He does a very good uh, omoplata sweep with the lapel. Three minutes and ten seconds left. Kyle is up by one advantage. Pedro Shumbo has to work. They both need to score. Right now they are both out of the semifinals. So they need a new new air to breathe. There you go, Pedro try to go for the clock choke. Going back on the lag. He could use that submission. 
Got Shumbo going in for the clock choke. It's very tight. Kai is trying to, to hold on what he can. Kai is doing a great job at defending and sitting back down. I guess but Shumbo an advantage for the near pass, an advantage for the clock choke, and now he is up on advantages in a very safe and good position for him. He's now on a full guard again. Delson trying to pass. Kayo tried to sweep. And his face is show he face his face shows exactly how is he feeling now. Kajushumbo likes that position. He can grind. Coming in from the MMA point and where he can ground and pound from that position. He's he's safe. He can apply the pressure. If Kayo turtles down, he goes for the clock choke. If he doesn't, he has a side control. You know? Very different clock choke with a grip on the pants. Applying pressure. Kayo trying to defend however he can. Petshumu is up on three advantages now. He needs to finish. If he finishes, he passes a uh, one into an mo and he's he's safe for now. Look how Delson is going on the top. Putting the right knee on the belly. He puts a lot of pressure on. Kai Wong is struggling right now. Delson tried to spin, but he didn't. Very nice knee, uh, defense by Kaio. Paddy Shumbo wants that clock and choke. He's going to switch now to a different variation of it. Going to go for the bow and arrow. He has it tight. Finishes. And then he taps. The crowd favorite, Kaio Almeida, taps. And Delson scores the victory by submission, which puts him again in the semifinal contention. He scores five points. And Guys, now he sums seven points in a total. We got to give it out to Kyle, man. A week ago, he was probably making plans of going to the beach this weekend. Michael, uh, Michael Liera got hurt. Kyle stepped in immediately. Uh, Jefferson told me that it took less than two minutes to convince him. So Kyle put everything on hold, start training. And now he's here. You know, he did great so far. It hasn't turned out the way he wanted to. Congratulations to Pedro Shumbo. Now he's in second place. Right now, if the tournament ends right now, Pedro Shumbo goes to the semifinals.